Hello everyone, my name is Rad Simmer, and this is my Sims 3 Generations Let's Play. Welcome back, people. It's about part 30, and the Let's Play is definitely wrapping itself up, but, of course, it's not over yet. So, this is little Lana, and we have Justin, too. Guess what? These two have had their children, and I know I didn't announce that they were kind of having... A baby but right after the wedding I did have them try for a baby and then I moved them out and then days got passed by and she was so pregnant and I was like you know what let me control her and change her outfit and everything and see how the apartment is is suitable for the kids and everything is looking very good this is Lana they all they both it's a boy and a girl they're twins too I did give her the fertility treatment because I wanted twins but Lana right here they all have kind of her dark skin tone and but his like eyes and hair which is so adorable um it's actually amazing and so that is lana she's so cute very cute mm. look at her adorable and then there is justin right here they they both they don't really look similar I don't know, he looks a lot like his dad, and she kind of looks like both of them. But, yeah, they both came out pretty much the same, just boy and a girl. Um, but they have a boy and a girl baby, isn't that sweet? Look. Yeah, none of them came out as dark as her, but they don't really look like her either. I mean, she's got black hair, dark complexion, and yellow eyes, and they all look exactly like him, you know? It's literally, like, exactly the same. You know? Oh, that's a cute picture. But I just wanted to show you guys the grandbabies, because we have them. And I am going to clip back to the, um, to Demi and Big's house, and I will see you guys then. Alright, guys, I am back, and it's the next day, and I have decided to make this the last part of Generations. And, um... I know it's a lot and it's like what but um I think it's time that we end generations because it's we've seen the days of it and I have lots of plans for the next let's play which I will of course announce um but let me invite our family over of course Axel aged up okay amazing we got Emmett Jillian Jet, and then the Williamsons, and we'll invite Tom Wardy. Okay. Since he's a good friend, and we took all his money. So, we are about to have a party. It's about 6 a.m., and little woman right here is pregnant. Yes, she is. So, yeah. Everyone is pregnant. Everyone's having babies. This is the idea of generations. But she looks glamorous. Very glamorous. Alright, girl. So how about you get started making drinks? Yeah. Um. How about you go create a new drink? Ooh. That's singing. Alright. And Big. What are you doing? Weirdo. Um. It's Big's birthday. Oh my god. He becomes an elder. <gasps> Shoo. That is nuts. Well, when we start the new next Let's Play, which I will announce right now, um, I will make a separate video on this, of course. But I have decided I'm going to be, once this is done, I'm going to be doing another Sims 3 Let's Play. Okay. It's going to be the Sims 3 Late Night. And I've decided to make the main characters, Jellybean and Demetria. Yes. So we are continuing the legacy, but in the Sims 3 Late Night LP. And I know it's kind of going to be shorter and everything, but I like continuing legacies with characters I've used. Because you can just do different things and the crowd knows them and loves them. So that is what I've decided to do. Everything that will happen with Demi and Big will happen in The Sims 3 late night 
And Jelly Bean is going to be our mixologist. She has been our mixologist since she was a teenager, okay? And she is going to get her bar. What is on her face? Is she, was she, like, bit by a vampire? What is this? I don't know. But, of course, we are going to be having Demetria, our character. She's going to be having a little baby. And, um... Jelly bean. So, ooh, we're gonna name this drink Jelly Bean. Okay. So, her little baby and them too. Of course, every single character will still be in the town. I'm gonna try to just, you know, start a new Let's Play. I'm not gonna do a new town or anything. But, yeah, I'm very excited. I think it's going to be amazing. So, in the new Let's Play, I think we'll be having a better house. Just because this house is very... I don't really like it too much. I mean, we can stay with it as we're like, you know, pretty much... It's, it's, it's a bachelor pad. It is pretty much, yes, a bachelor pad. But we will be having a child, so we may... Maybe want to get a nice -er home to just have the baby in. And um, Jelly Bean probably does not care. We are going to sell the house, just keep the cars, or just sell the cars and buy our own. But um, all of, we are still going to have working class people. She, I think, might go into the, she's already has her celebrity stars. So we can try to make her the musician of you know how they have came with all their musical instruments i think that is what we are going to do with demetria she's going to be the musician and um kind of just the experimental musician actress not actress but musician socialite type of girl and then we're gonna have jelly bean our bartender and i'm thinking one of their boyfriends will be our actor type of guy so, but we're going to start just with these two and her pregnant belly. So, I'm very excited. The family is coming over soon. So, we're just going to see them for one last time. And I will give everyone proper makeovers before um, I start the Let's Play. But, yeah, guys, I'm very, very excited. I really am. It's going to be a party. Alright, everyone... Get into your outfit. Okay, big. You can go to freaking work. I really am glad you are, actually. But here we are. Here's mom. There's Jillian. Oh, everybody's here. Axel. Tom Wardy. And I wish they brought the babies. Oh my god, Jillian's having a party. Really? Well, that's whatever. I wish they, uh, I hope they come with the babies, but usually they really don't. Yep, he's burning mac and cheese. Thank you, Alex. And is that, yep, there is Pandora. I'm so excited. But look, she's already wobbling. Oh my god, she's taking photos of Tom. Let's go announce the big news to our mom. Yes. Announce pregnancy. Is that... Did it really say... Ask to break up with Emmett? No, that's her dad. Um, let's do... Can they request to feel belly? Yes. She's like, feel my belly. I want to put her in her normal outfit, girl. I know you just want to wear sweats, but you've been dressing like a supermodel freaking your whole life. So, let me get this picture. Oh, and the birds are chirping. Alright, do it. Oh. Oh my god, Jelly Bean Mooch, $2 from Axel. <laughs> oh boy. But I'm thinking maybe we can get mom to play on the piano. Or maybe we'll play. Where's Pandora? 
Look at Axel. He's looking good. There we go. Look at the music. We got Jelly making drinks. Oh god, we're making romantic drinks. Who's in our kitchen by any chance? We got our dad, our uh, husband, and um... Where is Pandora? I bet they're all in the basement. Yeah, the freaking party's going down on here. Oh my god! Dad's playing the drums! Yeah. Maybe we should play the keyboard down here. Oh, nope. He's already on it. Let's play the guitar then. Look at Jet. He is just funny looking. And look at Pandora, our oldest daughter. She has really been successful. She is a investigator for the uh, Bridgeport PD. And you know, two, two kids, a chef husband. She's really made it for herself. And then there's Demi, who has chose a different life and- ooh. Sorry if my friggin' dog scared you. But, yes, Demetria working the guitar. I'm gonna go until everyone, before everybody leaves, go through all the family and talk about everything that has happened. Okay, we're gonna start with Jillian. There she is. Oh, she's so sweet. Oh, Jillian, so adorable. She really is the cutest. So, Jillian Rutherford, she came from a very uh, gothic y family. She pursued it and met, I think this is the story at least, met Emmett at a rock concert and um, they fell in love. Um, and then, you know what? She had three kids and then unexpectedly had a fourth. And she's loved every single one of them with all her heart and raised them so beautifully into these musicians. They're so smart. You know, she's a genius. Pandora's a genius. They're all geniuses and everything. She really gave good children. And, of course, with the help of Emmett, which is down here. Yep. Emmett was the caregiver. I mean, like the he was the working man. He was in a band and became a rock star. And uh, he's come so far. He's macked his guitar skill. He's pretty much knows all these instruments and that really passed on through his kids. And he really valued that the kids knew how to play music because he thought music was so important. And, um,. He definitely did that. He was head over heels for Jillian. You know when, like, the guy always likes the girl better? That was so him. Even though Jillian loved him, he was in love with her and was so happy to meet her and, you know, have four kids with her. It's really just beautiful. Um, Next, we have Pandora, who is the firstborn, the treasure kid. She... Oh my god, she's beautiful. Oh my god. Our sims are just so cute. Pandora here. She was kind of a nerdy, independent, but um, had red hair at one point. Red tips. Just like her mom. She was very much like her mom. And kind of grew to be a little bit independent. And realized what the life she really wants for herself. And she found a... You know, a city, normal city boy named Alex, and you know what? They got married and they had ch kids. She's living kind of the New York life. Not, I keep on calling the city New York, but it's pretty much New York. Like, come on. Um, she's pretty much living the life and the way she wants to. She was very gothic as a kid, just like her family, and she felt like she was pressured into doing that, so she did. And then once she kind of broke out, she became this independent woman. And she has no regrets, of course, but she's definitely very much loves the life that she has right now. Definitely. So, next is the little sister, Demetria. Let me see your face, girl. 
There we go. So, we got Demetria. She was the supposed. She was uh, the crazy girl. She did crazy things as, as a kid, jumping off walls. All what everything you can think of was Demi when she was a kid. And then she went to art school, or no, she went to prep school in the making. Uh, when she was a child, that came her very snobby, very I'm better than all of you, and she became this queen bee, uh, preppy, you know, very like the click girl, and from a rich family, she drew, she drove a uh, white Mercedes when she was 15, and um, she kind of became that girl, and she had this even though the family did come from a lot of money and she would have to work of course but she didn't really have to worry about finances and going to college and buying a house or even finding a job she wanted to be a little bit more rich and that's when she met Mr. Big Hartley right on her 18th birthday and they got married within a year and uh, she is now pregnant with his baby yes so, wherever that takes us, you shall see in the next Let's Play. So, we are not saying bye to this one. Next is Jellybean. Jellybean is Demi's best friend. Are they still best friends? I don't even know. So, Jellybean. She was the imaginary friend of Demi's. They're besties. I mean, they've kind of grown apart, but they will grow back together once, you know, the next Let's Play starts. And... Pandora made her real and now she is a living person. So pretty much Jellybean came into our lives when they were about 15-ish and she became the mixologist of the house, Loki, and now she dreams of owning a bar, being a bartender. And we are very happy to have her. She's been really great in uh, helping Demi and all. So, then there is Axel. Where are you, Axel? <laughs> there he is. He's just about to leave, actually. Um, let me see your face, boy. I like the hair. So, there is little baby Axel. He was the younger brother. He was, of course, like, the sweet little brother. And he was totally ladies' girl. Um, ladies' man. Yes. Ladies' girl, ladies' man. And we never really got to pursue Axel. I mean, we did, of course, but the main characters was definitely Demi and Pandora. Axel was just like our little, our son. And I have lots of plans. Maybe Axel and Jellybean might, you know, get together. I don't know. That would be amazing. But Axel, he's looking to continue in his father's footsteps and be a rock star. And I don't see that being impossible. So that is Axel, and then we have Jet, who was pretty much born when Pandora became an adult. So he's he's probably like 13 right now. He don't even know why Jet. I mean, he's he's our family. He's gonna be with mom and dad for a long time, but he's got dreads and went to reform school. <laughs> Hence the camo shirt. All right, guys. So. I think that about concludes the Sims 3 Generations with the Rutherfords. I really loved, 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 loved this Let's Play. And I will put together some type of thing where I can show you guys pictures that I've taken this Let's Play. Um, I'm so happy we revisited Bridgeport and actually decided to live here because, you know, we did go here for our honeymoon. So I am so, so happy to be living here and don't don't my game is about to freeze okay it didn't oh my god um so for you guys i want to thank you all very much for watching the family and i could never you know thank you all enough for this journey i've started this let's play with such good intentions and i'm completely ending it that way Thank you for everyone that's comments, left suggestions, and in the down bar will be the links to the whole family. So I'll have Demi, Jellybean, and um, then I'll have Jet and everyone on one side, and then a, I'll think I'll merge them or do different links. I don't know what I'm going to do, but 
that's about it for now, guys. Thank you all so very much for watching, and I will see you all in The Sims 3 late night. So, yeah. Bye, everybody.